I'm gonna take my glasses off really fast. This is what my eyebrows currently look like. So we're gonna do a technique. <laughs> we do in micro shaded. So it's a little bit different from micro bladed because it there's an ombre effect, right? So there's gonna be an ombre effect in my eyebrow. So yeah, it's gonna give me that uh, makeup eyebrow look without actually applying any makeup to it. So I'm really excited because the pictures I've seen so far look amazing. And one of my cousins got it done. Her results look flawless, so yeah. Stick around for the progress. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. As you guys already know from the intro of this video, I got my eyebrows microbladed, as you can see. And I'm gonna give you all the details on the entire process and everything, starting with the price to the healing process and everything. The full 360. So, before I begin this video, I do wanna just point out that I got my eyebrows done in Bogota, Colombia, and that's why they were so affordable. I paid $50 in Bogota, Colombia at this really chic lash studio to get my eyebrows microbladed. Well, actually, I got my eyebrows micro shaded, which I've Googled. It's a little bit different than microbladed, but it's uh, pretty much the same. It's along the same lines. They're just two different techniques. So the lash studio I went to is called Lash Studio in Bogota, Colombia, and they also do lip fillers. They do Botox. They do lip tinting and eyelash extensions, and it's all super affordable compared to uh, getting any of these things done in the States. This is what my eyebrows currently look like. I am, I think, on day three of the recovery and at first I thought they were a little bit too dark but they are lightening up now they're starting to heal and I read that they will look a lot more natural towards the end of it right now I'm just wearing a little bit of concealer no foundation but I am wearing a little bit of bronzer chapstick some eyeliner I have no makeup on my eyebrows and as you can see it does look like I have makeup on them I, I am wearing a little bit of ointment that they gave me for the healing process so as you can see that's on there for starters I just want to say that if you are thinking about getting microblading in the United States of America you're gonna be looking at maybe like on the cheap route $250 and that's like a group on where you know you might not be able to see a lot of pictures or this person's uh, experience or credibility so that's always a risk. I also found a lot of Groupons in the $300 range. Um, some of them did have Instagrams, but they were nowhere near the quality and experience that uh, the person I went to had. And it was very visible in their pictures. So that's that. I think on average you will pay anywhere from $300 to maybe $600 for getting your eyebrows microbladed. I paid $50 because I got them done in Bogota, Colombia. For starters, I have family there. so. I do not pay the cost of a hotel. For me, it was just worth it to get them done there. If I didn't have family there, would I take the risk of flying there to just get the uh, microblading done? Is it worth it? Well, I live in New York and the flights to Bogota, Colombia are not that expensive. So if I had to do it all over again without having the accommodation of my family's apartment, I would definitely do it. I also speak Spanish because I was born in Venezuela, so that also comes into play. Now, um, I do know that there is a doctor there and she focuses on doing lip fillers and Botox services. And while I don't believe that the gentleman who did my eyebrows speaks English, I do know that this doctor that also works there, she is very fluent in English. So if you guys did want to um, take the same route as me and fly over there and get this done, then you do have somebody that speaks English there. Now, the place that I went to is viral on Instagram. They have 174,000 followers, which is major. Their pictures are amazing. Like, you can tell that the quality of their work was just amazing and flawless based on their Instagram. So that also played a huge role into me choosing this place and going there. 
Now, the place that I went to is called Lash Studio in Bogota, Colombia, and they offer three kinds of microblading techniques. I got something that's called micro shading. So in my opinion, based on the pictures I've seen, because I don't know too much about like the difference in the techniques, but from my opinion, micro shading gives you more of like a drawn on makeup look, if that makes any sense. You know when you take a uh, your eyebrow pen and you're painting on your eyebrows and then you clean it up with concealer right before you're about to like beat your face. That is the micro shading look for me. It, it just looks more of like makeup-ish and more of like perfect. I think microblading makes them look more full and natural. And that is the other technique that they offer there. And the third uh, service they offer there is a combination of both microblading and micro shading. Now I just want to talk about prices really quick. So. It starts at 200,000 uh, Colombian pesos, which is around $50, and that is for microblading alone. Micro shading costs 250,000 Colombian pesos, which is around 65 US dollars. The last one, which is a combination of both techniques, costs 300,000 Colombian pesos. So it's $50 for microblading, $65 for micro shading, and the combination of both is around 75 US dollars still a lot cheaper and uh, way more affordable than the States. Now, when I got my eyebrows done, I chose micro shading, so it cost 65 US dollars. However, I wasn't aware that they were having a promotion of 50,000 Colombian pesos off, so I ended up paying 50 US dollars, so I got it even cheaper, and I didn't find this out until I was going to like pay, and so that was pretty amazing. I'm not complaining about that. Who doesn't love discounts? I was going to talk about the process really quick. So it did seem like the person I went to was super experienced. Um, he is a young man from Venezuela and he currently works and lives in Bogota, Colombia. And he's super, super talented. He's super professional. I also want to mention that this beauty studio was gorgeous. It was super chic, super clean. And they just really made you feel comfortable. I just want to start out with the pain question. Did it hurt? No. So actually... The area of my eyebrows was entirely numbed before. I believe they let the numbing cream sit for about half an hour and it kicked in. And after that, he started drawing and measuring the eyebrows and he'll show you what they look like with um, kind of like a marker that he uses. He'll show you what it looks like with the marker. If you're satisfied with the look and the shape and everything, then he'll go ahead and start the process. I personally thought that my eyebrows were a little bit too thick when he first showed them to me and when I tried to tell him that he reassured me that I should just trust the process and that they would not look as thick in the end and that's exactly what I did and I couldn't be happier with my results. How long did it take? It took two hours. The process took two hours from start till finish. So that means from the time that he starts numbing your eyebrows, letting it sit for half an hour, drawing everything on, and then actually like getting this machine that kind of resembles like a tattoo machine, but it's not as loud and obnoxious as like getting a tattoo. From the time all of this happened from start to end, it was two hours. I'd say that that's pretty fast because like how talented this man is. He he knew what he was doing. He wasted no time and he just got straight to it. And I think two hours is like a fair amount of time to spend on something that's gonna be on your body for, you know, the next couple of months. He told me that the eyebrows would last anywhere from 12 to 18 months, obviously depending on your skin and how well your skin heals or deals with like scar and stuff like that. So I'm not one to really wear a lot of makeup. Usually I just kind of sometimes I'll throw on a little bit of mascara and um, concealer and maybe some bronzer. So I kind of wanted um, the fake drawn on like the makeup eyebrow look, but not dramatic. I wanted more of a natural look and I feel like um, after the healing process is done, I will have the exact results that I want. Right now they are just sitting in some ointment that I was given. So, it is a little bit uh, dark for me at the moment, but I am going to trust the process. So, with that being said, let's talk about the healing process. So, in total, it's going to take around 30 days for my eyebrows to fully heal. I'm currently on day three or four, I believe, of the healing process. And this is the stage where they're starting to feel itchy and I really, really want to scratch them. 
but of course that's never like a good idea don't scratch your eyebrows if you guys are thinking about getting microbleed in whenever they feel itchy i will just take a q-tip get the ointment and just reapply just it just means that like they feel dry because they are healing so it's normal for them to feel dry and i'll just reapply some ointment on there and it usually tames the itchiness. The first week they will be very dark and you'll kind of like see that there's ink on your eyebrows. And then the second week I believe there's supposed to be like some sort of um, scarring and peeling and then maybe some like red tones that appear. And then towards the third and fourth week you will start to see them lighten and look a lot more natural. So yeah, that is it for the healing process. I will update you guys um, when I get more towards the end of the healing process but for now this is what my eyebrows currently look like as you can see if you guys are interested in the studio that i went to i will leave their instagram down below i will also leave my instagram down below if you have any more questions that i can answer for you you can definitely feel free to just shoot me a dm and i will respond to you as soon as i can so yeah that is uh pretty much i think i've covered everything on uh, the whole microblading experience. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Feel free to subscribe and hit that like button and leave some comments down below. Thank you guys for watching and see you next time. I love it. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs>